in this video I'm going to show how you can do hand lettering tool. First I decide where I want to fit the alphabet. In this case I wish to fit the alphabet in the middle of the page. So I'm giving equal distances from all sides of the page. With the help of a pencil and scale I'm marking the space where I need to fit the letters. the alphabets. With a clearly visible pen or a marker, make the outline of the alphabets. Then I fill color inside the outline like we work in a coloring book. Here's another demonstration of the letter M. Also make sure that they are equally spaced. I am completing the letters N and E in the similar fashion. If you are not confident with keeping a steady flow, try practicing making straight lines and curves. Even when doing a fair work, it's okay to not get the perfect line or curve or thickness at the first go. You can always perfect it each time you overwrite on it. Though always be mindful of maintaining the thickness for all the alphabets. The key is to always keep practicing and experimenting new words with different forms. Don't be afraid to add your personal touch to the font. Lettering or typography is not just limited to alphabets. It's about presenting those alphabets creatively. You can add small drawings of sparks, glitters, stars, flowers, Anything that goes well with the alphabets. Here I'm adding a darker color outline to the alphabets so as to make them look more distinct. You can add curves, subtract curves, make curves curvier. Truly there is no limit to creativity. You can also add shadow effect to the alphabets using a darker, distinctly colored pen or pencil. If you are a beginner or struggling to write a font by yourself, Google is always there to help. For instance, you can search fonts on Da Font, Behance, Google Fonts or even Canva to gain inspiration on different sorts of fonts. Here I am leaving small space so as to give an effect of glint. Even if you make mistakes, 
try to include them seamlessly into the form. Here are the finished pieces. If you are a beginner or struggling to do hand lettering, I hope this video helped you and gave you an insight into presenting your words creatively.